This is Duke University. The English for International Students program is a language support program for international graduate and professional students enrolled at Duke. Our program offers advanced courses in academic writing, oral communication, pronunciation, academic presentations, and grammar. Uh, these are semester-long courses that students take alongside their departmental courses. We are a language support program. So even though many students have to take our courses as a requirement, we really do see ourselves as trying to work alongside of our students in progressing in their uh, academic work. And so um, frequently we have them actually take writing that they're doing in another course and bring it into our course and then more specifically focus on the language aspects of what they are doing. And a lot of the, what we have read and understood about teaching is that what is most effective for students is when it is student-centered. So it's not that I come into a class of we're going to do these things in these ways. Um, instead it's I go in and I ask students, I ask faculty, I ask other people, um, I ask fellow teachers, what is it that students need? And then we collaborate on the best way to get there and to accomplish that. We're always trying to make our, our projects as useful as possible in class so that they aren't doing things just to work, that they're actually going to be able to take those things into the real world and use them. I think it's tremendously helped me in improving the skills that I'm lacking in in terms of English. The EIS program is really good in detecting what you're lacking in. I knew from the beginning that I was lacking in presentation skills because I didn't have a lot of opportunities in the past to make informal or formal presentations. So taking this presentation class with EIS really helped me in terms of building up my confidence speaking in front of people. In Italy, uh, the academic writing is completely different from a linguistic point of view. Here I have to learn a lot about this, uh, this new intellectual environment in general and in particular about uh, the academic writing uh, fields. At the beginning I thought the class was just going to be about writing and uh, I was very happily surprised that the class is about analyzing and learning new tools. So we do a bunch of writing but the core of the class is learning tools uh, learning material and knowing where to look for it. The student is in my oral communications class and is from a writing class, a literature review that she created. She's taken and put into presentations form and then brought it into the oral communication class and for one of our projects was able to improve the project and then she went to a conference, presented, won an award, for her best presentation and she learned a lot from both writing the literature review and then putting it in, into a setting in our classroom where she could present successfully on it. I really appreciate the opportunity because at, initially it would be super difficult for you to start a literature review in, in English especially, but after you get through that process and you, it helps you with your kind of professional study, it's not a burden in fact. It's, some, it's like a booster for you to work you better through your graduate study. So we offer one-on-one -on -one consultations in speaking as well as in writing. So students schedule these sessions with an expert consultant whom they meet with to work on a specific task or a specific assignment. I had a student who came into pronunciation and he told me from the beginning, I'm not good at pre presentations, I'm not confident at them, I know I'm going to have to present my dissertation, I don't know how I'm going to do that. Um, it's very overwhelming and so I worked with him both in class and then I also referred him to some outside resources that we have. Um, he met with one of our EIS instructors for speaking consultations and it was and he worked very hard and it was really really cool to see at the end between what he himself had put in and the guidance and support he had received from our department how well he did on his final presentation in the class um, that I knew that all of these different resources that he had that he would be much better prepared in the future for the presentations he would have to give later on. Because it's English for international students, you will find like a lot of students for international students. 
So you feel, you feel better there because you know that some struggles that you are facing, others also are facing. It's nice to just see that you're not alone there. Uh, Duke is a fantastic place to be and to study and the graduate school and the EIS provide a lot of uh, resources for international students and it's pretty good, it's pretty useful and you feel very welcome here.